All right, so let's talk a little bit about why Xerox has gotten involved with on-demand books for this very unique solution. Uh, we began working with on-demand books actually at this show four years ago is when we first started. And we had a marketing arrangement with them in February, and then we took a much larger arrangement position to sell and service this entire device. And Xerox looked at this, and this is the last link in creating the new supply chain for books. This takes the ultimate inventory management story for the publisher to the ability to never carry inventory for any book and not have to ship. This is a demand-driven solution. And we looked at this and said, this is not only good because it creates a new model for a retailer, this completes the entire value chain for the new supply chain for books, which Xerox already supplies equipment for on the POD side. From a technology standpoint and how this works, it's really very simple. We use the Xerox 4112 as the printer. We have an Epson color printer, and we have on-demand books, unique and proprietary binding solution in the middle. The titles sit out in a catalog, which is out on the net. The customer comes in, looks for the book, finds the title he wants, the operator pushes a button. From that pushing of the button, the text file is loaded into the text printer, the cover file goes over to the cover printer, the text prints, the pages go into an accumulator that fits in the binder, drops down onto the adhesive binder, the cover's been printed, the cover comes over under the book, it's adhesive bound, it drops down to the bottom, it's trimmed three sides and goes out a shoot in the back. We call it click to clunk. Click to clunk's about five minutes. So it's quick, it's very easy, it's very clean. So you, you do all those things together, why we like the company and how this technology works. And you've got a solution that going into the marketplace for the book retailer, whether it's the bookstore, the college bookstore, trade bookstore, university libraries, government, this enables them to bring a huge number of titles, titles together. Most of the titles that sit out there in these networks that are of high value but have long tail are scholarly and academic titles and they are worth a lot of money to those people who want the information. So it's high value product. You're not going to do Harry Potter on this machine, but you're going to do a lot of scholarly and academic work and that we're doing research on economics, or math, or any of these kinds of subjects, this has got it. Or you're looking for books that haven't been in print since 1900, which the, most of the books prior to the 1800s were all scholarly and academic. This machine will provide that because we have the books from the Google Library Project sitting here as part of the catalog. So that creates a lot of value and it drives the demand and this is the only access, the only way that you can get them.